What's up, everybody? Welcome to Lizzie's Lizzie's budget, busy Lizzie's budget. <laughs> See, I tried to switch up the opening and obviously I can't. So thank you so much for being here today. I'm so glad you came. Today, I'm gonna try to give you a fairly short video because I am exhausted and I, I don't even have a whole lot to say. I had some happy mail. I was all excited to show you guys and I lost it. It's just because my office is a mess. But the reason why and most of you probably already know this, is I'm about to launch my first product in my first physical product in my Etsy shop, which is the same name as my channel. It's Busy Lizzie's Budget. Just doesn't have the apostrophe. Right now, everything in there are printable items or digital downloads that my daughter, Addie, or Busy Junior, has made. And so now she she gets all of the money from that, all the proceeds, but now I'm going to be making some money working hard on making these items for you. So if you haven't seen it, it is a low income savings challenge book and I am so excited to start shipping these out to you guys. I'm excited for all of us to start using them. Oops. I grabbed the wrong one. I grabbed the wrong one to show you. This has the numbers. Okay. Scratch that, I'm not gonna show you. Okay, but it if you do wanna see it, it's in my last video. So, sorry about that. We'll show you the back cover, but anyway, I just wanted to remind you that these are gonna go up in my shop this Saturday. So, today's Friday, so tomorrow morning at 11 o'clock my time, which is Eastern Standard Time. So, 11 o'clock tomorrow, there will be a minimum of 20. Right now I have about 22 and I'm planning to make a bunch more tomorrow or as many as I can because I'm filming this on Thursday. So by tomorrow, I mean Friday. So anyway, thank you to all of you who left comments, who sent me messages, who inquired about this. And it sounds like you guys are all super excited about this with me. And that just means the world to me. And thank you so much for being so supportive like you guys always are. Let me tell you a quick announcement from my daughter. She asked me to talk to you guys on my very next video and just to let you know that she is away in Montreal with school. And the reason why she wanted you guys to know this is that this past week, I believe four different people asked me to ask Addie to make custom savings challenges. And one of the one of the people wanted three different ones. So I don't think anyone was in a rush, but I just wanna let you know, she is excited to work on all of them, but she's not here. So she said, let them know that I can't do it because I'm not there. So anyway, she will get to those, but it's not gonna be quick and that is why. She, this is her last week of school, or next week is her last week of school. She's graduating on Thursday from eighth grade. So she has a bunch of other activities and things at night and it's just a little crazy. So anyway, um, so that's my announcement from her. And today we're going to do two things. Either Ranger's trying to open the door. That's Kendra. Um, Kendra? Ranger? Okay, I need to go see if someone's in my house. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. That was a little scary. I'm in my office in the basement and I have two doors, one on either side. And one of the knobs turned and no one was there. So Ranger's down here with me, but it wasn't him. And Kendra's not here, even though she said she was stopping by. So pray for me all, <laughs> pray for me that nothing happens and I'm home alone. Okay, all right, let me try to keep going. So we're gonna just do two things in this video. We're gonna do a Ranger update and we're going to show you one piece of happy mail or happy mail from one person. So. I'm just gonna try to do it quickly. I am so tired because I've been trying to crank out these savings challenge books for you guys. And it takes a long time, especially because I take the same amount of time on every single one. I'm very meticulous. We'll just say it, I'm OCD. I triple check things. I want them all to be perfect. So I'm tired, but I'm happy tired because this is a dream come true for me. For about 10 years, I've wanted to list something on, I've wanted to, Sorry, not list things. I wanted to open an Etsy shop and sell physical items. So I am so excited, you guys. Okay, so let's do the happy mail first. Now, I this is something, there is something I ordered and I forget where it's from. It's not from this country though, but I forget what country it's from. I feel bad I forget, I should have checked, but I ordered something and this is what I ordered. I saw this and if you guys watch 
Madeline Budgets, my bestie, she did a Never Have I Ever that was made by Liz and Les. And I thought it was really fun hearing her stories and just learning more about her. So when I saw this scratch off, I had to have it. I thought it was the coolest thing ever. And I'm going to do it um, with my 80s and 90s binders because it's a game I played a lot when I was little where, you know, you'd ask your friends these questions. So this is from Lou Nova B on Etsy. Her name is Brittany and this is what I ordered. And I also ordered because I was paying shipping for already, you know, from it was actually very inexpensive shipping because it was coming from so far, but I decided to see if there's anything else in the shop I liked. And I'm so glad that I ended up going through the shop because you guys look what I found. And I need to know, Brittany, if you're watching, how you got this co these colors so vibrant. These are the most vibrantly colored challenges I've ever seen. This one is, and it is so adorable. And it's a like a sloth scratch off game. I am so excited about this, you guys. So that is what I ordered, but that is not all I got. Let me show you all I got. I got this big, big envelope. And it's funny because when it came in the mail, I, I saw the shop name on the outside and I knew I had only ordered a piece of paper. And so before I saw the shop name, sorry, let me back up. I went, that's interesting. It can't be, it can't be Happy Mail because this is not my P.O. box. It came to my house. I'm like, but I didn't order a ton of stuff. And then I realized the name and I said, well, we're going to have to open it up and see what it is. So it's an envelope in my favorite color, purple, of course, you know, purple and turquoise. And then look at this, you guys, this is so beautiful. I'm just going to show you all of the things that were in here. It is going to blow your mind. Seriously, after I opened this, Matt was home and Kendra was coming over. We were all going out to eat and I literally started crying because I could not believe. I was so overwhelmed after finishing opening this and I'll just show you. Again, purple, my favorite color, purple dice. So beautiful. And then the, oh, you guys look at this. Okay, so these are obviously little freebies, but Luda, her cat, and Nova, her doggy. And then Matt said, oh, well, that's where she got her shop name with Luna and Nova and then her name, Brittany. So that was, I think that's pretty cool, but what a great idea to use her pets as freebie scratch offs. So these are so cute. I'm so excited. There's a little thank you card and a sticker. And then I'm not going to put everything away on camera. I'll do that. Oops. I'll do that later, but there's so much more stuff in here, you guys. So then there was my ducks are absolutely not in a row. So another game and then look how beautiful this is. It is my favorite color, teal, turquoise. And Rakaya, if you're watching, I know that you're going to love this color too. But this is just so gorgeous and I love it. And I can't wait to do this one as well. And then I found the letter. Oops, <laughs> kind of went out of order. I'll read it to you guys quickly. It says, Lizzie, thank you so much for your order. I was so excited when I saw it was you. I love your YouTube channel. I'm always waiting for the next movie. I don't ever comment um, because I'm shy um, unless you ask for an emoji. Um, so I'm not going to read it word for word, but I just realized maybe she doesn't want me to read it. But she said, I sent some freebies to use or to do what you want with. I really hope you enjoy the savings challenges. Happy savings. P.S. I know you don't love peacocks, but just look at that color. Brittany. She said, I also included $20 for Ranger. I've been wanting to send it for a while now. So this just touched me so much, you guys. This is just like the Mary Poppins um, Happy Mail. She sent $20 for Ranger, which was so, so sweet. And I really thought she was from another country, but she sent our money. Anyway, now I have to go see where she's from. And then in here, we've got, I didn't even know I was getting these envelopes for the challenges never have I ever the sloth one and look how cute this is you guys and the ducks in a row another super cute one so envelopes for three of the four of those challenges and then it just keeps going these are definitely laminated with five mil and these are little challenges I can do in my mini binders but there are they're animal savings can you guys see this Nita, look how cute that is. Look at these owls. I just love these. So this is $85. These are just such good quality and you can reuse them. This one, and oh my gosh, I just love the colors. Tracy, you'd probably love those colors. This is only 65. This one is 105. And then I love the colors on this one, the teal and the pink and the gold. Um, 
And this one is a mystery one, so we don't know the amount. So you guys, I was blown away by all this. And Brittany, I don't think I've had a chance to send you a message yet, but I just, so I knew I wanted to put it on, on a video right away so you could see that I got it. But I think it was a combination of everything from the purple dice, which is my favorite color, this beautiful bag, these beautiful letter, says she watches my channel, money for Ranger, all these freebies, all these more freebies. It, and then saying she even knows that I don't like peacock animals. Obviously, Brittany knows me very well and pays really pays attention. And just, I thought that was just so thoughtful and so sweet. And I don't even want to scratch these, you guys. I want to put them up on my wall in front of me where I have, um, where I have Ren's, um, pictures of Ren's animals, um, Lupin and I think Panda and Raven are her cats. So anyway, let me just put this all aside, but this, I cannot wait to go back to her shop and look at what else she has. You guys should all check out her shop. I don't think she has a channel, but I will list the shop in the description box. There will be a link, Lou Nova B, and please favorite her shop so you can see updates. And I am so glad that by searching, I happened to find this challenge, which happened to bring me to her shop, and now I know her. So thank you so much, Brittany. I seriously cannot thank you enough for your generosity. It just, I literally, I just had teary eyes after, and I just sat there in awe, and they were like, let's go, we gotta go. And I'm like, I can't go. I just can't believe this is all for me from Brittany. And it just, it really touched me in a way you wouldn't even understand. So thank you so, 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 so much. And... Why don't I just throw these in the, let's throw these flowers in here since we have nothing on my screen. Okay, so now we're going to do a ranger update and it's not going to take long, you guys. It's going to be quick because I need to get back to working on my books. So let's see. So now that you've seen me open that happy mail, wait, where did I put that money? I need that money. Okay, let me grab it back. Okay, there we go. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to show you this really quickly. So there is a lady who watches my channel and I don't know who she is, but her name is Magda. I'll just give you her first name. She surprised the daylights out of me and sent $125 to the business PayPal or to the PayPal in the description box of my videos. Um, I was in shock for about three days. I was not expecting that. Um, I just, I, it's hard for me to even process that someone would do that for me and for us. And you guys, so many of you have, and I just, I still can't get, I still just can't express how much it means. It's just no words. Okay. So Magda sent that and she just said something about, it was very quick. And it just said something about, um, that she watched my, she loved my videos or whatever. And she said, um, this was for us. And she said, and she said something about give my love to Ranger or something to that effect. So I sent her, I emailed her back immediately and sent her a really nice thank you and asked if specifically there's something she would want us to use the money for, if she wanted it to be all for Ranger, if it was for other stuff, if it was for me, if it, whatever. And she didn't write back yet. So, um, so I decided, here's what I decided to do. I ended up, because I'm opening my shop or opening my shop for physical items, um, I ended up having to buy a new printer and so new ink, I have to buy a ton of paper. I've had to buy a ton more ink and a ton more ink to print all these um, very, very vividly colorful challenge pages. I had to buy rings to put in them, lamination paper. My laminator broke, I bought a nicer laminator. I bought thicker laminating paper. Um, and basically the list goes on. And so launching this product, it's probably gonna be a couple months until I recoup what I actually made make in profit. So anyway, I'm not complaining. I'm excited. I'm really excited for this adventure. But because of all of that, and I didn't want to keep any balance on the credit card, and there's probably more things too. But oh, yes, bubble mailers, lots of bubble mailers. <laughs> anyway, I wanted to, um, I decided that this 125, since I haven't heard back from her, 
I'm going to use for savings challenges because I know last Wednesday we didn't have too much to work with and this coming one we probably won't either. So I'm going to use this for savings challenges and you guys all know when the savings challenges are done that money goes to Ranger anyway. So that's what I decided to do but I really wanted to um, shout her out and just thank her. So I did put this on here and it was donated and his name was on the email so I want to keep this as part of our total. However, we will not be stuffing that 125. So th let me move on. So Kathy, Kathy Snyder is someone who watches my channel and comments on every single video at least once, has been watching for a really long time, um, love her comments to pieces. She is the sweetest and we just have a, we just have a great bond, a great connection. She's just amazing and um, we just love her like family. She had asked Addie to make the Las Vegas savings challenge and then she had sent $25 and said to me, um, through Venmo or PayPal or something so there'd be no fees. And she said, I want you to spread the, spread the love. She said, give some to Addie, give some to Ranger, have some for yourself, get a drink, do something. So here's what I decided to do. So she very generously and kindly sent 25. So I gave 10 to Addie for creating that challenge because that was a lot of work. I, I'm giving 10 to Ranger from her, which is right here. And I kept five. And I'm not sure what happened to it. But anyway, so that's that's the scoop. So thank you so much to Kathy. And thank you again to Brittany. So here's the money from Kathy and Brittany. So we're actually only stuffing the $30 today, which is fine, which is absolutely fine. So this update is weeks for weeks 16 and 17 since he's been sick. So technically we got a total of 155. We're up to 128 different contributors, and we hit over four thousand dollars, forty-one fifty-eight. So that's just unbelievable. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to put this in Ranger's envelope, but let me just tell you quickly, um, cause I always forget to give the update now. And if, um, I definitely have some pictures, not too many, um, but I definitely have some pictures and I think I have a video. I can't remember what it was of, but I feel like I might have a video of him, but I'll have Matt roll the stuff while I'm talking. But I just wanted to tell you guys, oh my goodness, he's so cute. So he's still on his medicine. He's still he's take, taking basically three medicines. He's taking three medicines, prednisone, ondansetron, which is an anti-nausea medicine. And he's taking um, yeah. All right. I'm going to have to think about this for a second. Okay, and he's still taking metronidazole, the um, antibiotic. So anyway, um, in the morning, he just has these little pills or halves of them or whatever. And so what we do is we tell he usually sleeps in the bathroom because it's nice and cool on the tile. And we say, we call him, we say, Ranger, it's peanut butter time. And he comes right out and sits down and we put, the, put a nap, napkin on the floor, put his pills on it grab the, his tub of peanut butter. We have one that's just for him now. We grab like a plastic little kid's spoon, um, little kid's knife or spoon, whatever, and put some peanut butter on there. And then literally, I have to, I have to get a video of this, but literally we um, put, I'll put my finger on the peanut butter, grab some peanut butter, then push down on a pill, which will then stick, put more peanut butter on the back, put my finger up and he's on this side and he takes it. So, it's gotten to the, he used to try to spit them out and just take the peanut butter, but it's gotten to the point now where when one starts to fall down my finger or fall out of his mouth, he grabs it because like he knows he has to have it. So it's just become such a routine, which is, I just think it's adorable. But and I, there you go on cue, he's barking. So Kendra must be here. So anyway, it's super cute. So I have to get a video of that. It's so easy to give him his pills now, which is awesome. So he's still doing really well. He's getting more strength. I've been able to take him for walks now. He can start to go a little further, a little further. Um, he's When he shakes his body, he shakes stronger. His tail's wagging harder. He's just really doing well. And he's not eating as much as he was, but he was eating way, he was eating way more than he was supposed to, which the doctor said, or the vet said was absolutely fine because he had lost so much weight and needed to gain some back. But now he's doing just about two meals a day, sometimes a little less. But anyway, um, he's doing really well. And it's been for the past, since the last update, it's basically been very cold and rainy, hence the uh, flannel on my shirt. And um, I didn't even realize it was, it was for flannel Friday. I didn't even realize that. Anyway, um, he's doing really well. And 
he's, you know, he's had his second, his second Addison's shot a couple weeks ago. So we really think that's what he has now. So he's doing great. And, oh, I was going to say because of the cold and the rain, it went from 95 degrees to in the forties. So it's been cold and rainy every day, which he hates. And, oh, it's Matt. Hi, Matt. Um, it must be 5.30. So anyway, um, he, now I lost my train of thought, but um, he's doesn't like the cold or the rain. He's doing pretty well, but he just hasn't been able to spend time outside, which he loves the sun. So I hope we get the summer weather back soon. So anyway, I think that's enough information about him. Let's go ahead and get out. So we have, I'm going to put this, this sheet away. We have this $30 that we're going to... Um, we have to put toward um, what you guys have donated to him. So there's nothing for me in here right now, but from you guys, there was left over $57. So we're going to add this to the 57. So I don't think it's going to make a hundred, but that's totally fine. Every little bit helps. So let's count it. So we have 20, 40, 50, 65, 75, 80, 81, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 87. $87. If things were not so tight this month for us, I would have added 13 to this, but I don't have 13 to pull from anywhere. So let's change this to 87. I'm going to be, oh, I could have just changed the five to an eight and EE e. would have loved that. Oh, oh, well. All right. I think it might be too late to recover that one, but yeah, let's change that five to an eight. Okay. So 87 we have left from you guys. And because I was not going to do a video for two weeks with his updates. I'm not doing them weekly anymore as he's getting better and things are slowing down. But I had finished, I believe, four savings challenges in a Wednesday video a couple weeks ago. And I knew I wouldn't be doing this for a long time. And I didn't want to hold all that money in the house. So I went ahead and deposited that money to the bank. It was 300 and I think 70 something dollars. And I'll be honest with you, I used that 70 something, I needed it, but that 300, I went and made a payment. I think I took a screenshot. If I did, I'll put up the picture here now, but whether I took the screenshot or not, um, from my savings challenges, we paid $300 toward the care credit card. So the balance is, is going down, which is super nice. So I get to color in three. So I think there's probably a couple more little things I was going to tell you. So maybe I'll do that while I color this in. Um, but we are still waiting and waiting for bills from the vet. So in the past, maybe, I don't think we've gotten a vet bill for two months and he's had so many appointments and especially two months ago, which is when, or whenever it was that around the time where we thought, you know, he was about to die, he had all these emergency appointments and, you know, he had he was given IV fluids, he was given shots, medicine, they took his blood every time. I'm talking four days in a row. So, you know, of course, two of them being weekend days. So I've been asking for a long time. I just want to know what we owe. And I just want to have the final numbers and, you know, make a second chart for it because it's going to be more than this. So, but they still haven't done the paperwork. So I don't know what's going on. So basically, like we went in just to get him the Addison shot. And that's all we did that day. And they just said, we'll put it on your tab. And then, you know, I'll run in to grab him his prescription dog food or medicine refills and just put it on the tab. So anyway, um, I have no clue what that ending balance is going to be, but I'm not going to worry about that for now. It's almost nice that we're getting this squared away before we get that next big bill. So, but anyway, um, so I think that's about it. Let me go ahead and fast forward the rest of this. This is such a pretty color. Okay, this is so neat, you guys. So this is what I've paid off, and this is what you guys have donated. And I think we're gonna meet kind of in the middle, close enough. Anyway, thank you guys so much. You guys are so generous and just so sweet. And um, I did forget to say something. I just wanted to say about tomorrow for Saturday at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time when these go on my Etsy shop. I forgot to say that for this launch, I am only, I am not doing 
any other country. This is going to be U.S. only, and I'm very sorry about that, but I don't even know how to ship within the U.S. using the Etsy program, so I need to learn that first. And then I'm hoping that as I get used to it, that I'm hoping I'll be able to have the time to learn to ship other places. So hopefully in the near future, I'll be able to ship to other people. So I am really sorry if you're not in the U.S. and you're not able to get in on this if you wanted to. I really do apologize, but just hang in there because we'll figure this out. And there was one more thing I was going to say too, and I don't remember. So, oh, I was going to say that for the last few videos, I may not be able to do comments or I might just do really short comments or just read it and put a heart because I'm spending all this time trying to get as many of the um, books done as I can for the launch. So anyway, if I'm, I usually do try to write back to every comment. So if I don't, that's why I really do love you all. Thank you so, so much for watching and just for your love and your encouragement and your support. You guys are awesome. And I'll see you Saturday over on Etsy. I hope you have a wonderful weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.